On Wednesday, Pope Francis met with leaders of different Christian denominations and also with heads of other religions. The group came to Rome precisely to attend his inaugural mass. The group was in Rome to attend his inaugural mass. The leader of the Orthodox Church, Bartholomew I, greeted the Pope and said his humility will bring the Christian message across Santita. to a lot of people. La scelta della semplicità da parte della vostra amata e onorata santità ha reso e rende evidente il criterio che vi guida nella scelta dell'essenziale. Ciò riempie di speranza i cuori di tutti, i vostri fedeli sparsi nel mondo e in generale di tutti gli uomini. The chairman of Moscow's Patriarchate, Hilarion, was also among the guests. Pope Francis highlighted that the Church is committed to promoting unity among believers, especially now that the Church is celebrating the Year of Faith and the 50th anniversary of the Second Vatican Council. Da parte mia, desidero assicurare sulla scia dei miei predecessori la ferma volontà di proseguire nel cammino del dialogo ecumenico. Il ringrazio sin d'ora il Pontificio Consiglio per la promozione dell'unità dei cristiani. The Pope also greeted Jewish and Muslim representatives. He acknowledged their special relationship with the Church, but he also called on them to make a commitment for a peaceful coexistence. La Chiesa Cattolica è consapevole dell'importanza che ha la promozione dell'amicizia e del rispetto tra uomini e donne di diverse tradizioni religiose. Questo voglio ripeterlo. Promozione dell'amicizia e del rispetto tra uomini e donne di diverse tradizioni religiose. After his speech, the Pope greeted each representative one by one. And perhaps the friendliest greeting was with a rabbi from Buenos Aires, which is the city where Bergoglio was archbishop. The Pope received several gifts that reflected all the cultural and religious diversity in the room. The gifts included these eastern icons and also this bright African cross. His visit to the Arabian Peninsula is the first ever for a pontiff, and it was here, in the birthplace of Islam. The atmosphere that we have seen there, this was something which I have never witnessed in my journalistic career in the UAE, which is I have been in the country for more than 15 years. This was, uh, this was one of a kind. He entered the stadium to tens of thousands chanting his name. Speaking the message of the Gospel of Jesus Christ in the Cradle of Islam, Pope Francis became the first sitting pontiff in history to visit the Arabian Peninsula and hold a mass. The pontiff also met the Grand Imam of Egypt's Al-Azhar Mosque, the highest authority in Sunni Islam. The meeting saw the two and other religious representatives sign a document promoting interfaith dialogue, religious freedom and peace. Francis met religious leaders in the United Arab Emirates they included Sunni Muslim leader Sheikh Ahmed al Tayeb. They looked at how they can foster peace between their faiths. This message is for the Muslims in the East. You must embrace your Christian brothers. They are partners in our nation and our siblings, whom the Holy Quran deems as close fellows. From how important would you say the developments we're hearing about coming out of Abu Dhabi are on this trip? This is uh, very significant given both visually and uh, substantially. I think uh, 
the Pope Francis has lived up to his reputation of it's definitely a signal that he wants to build bridges. He wants to say, look, Islam is changing, it can change, and it also wants to change. La mayor parte de los habitantes del planeta se declaran creyentes. Esto debería provocar un diálogo entre las religiones. No debemos dejar de orar por él y colaborar con quienes piensan distinto. Confío en Buda. Creo en Dios. Creo en Jesucristo. Creo en Dios. Alá. Muchos piensan distinto, sienten distinto. Buscan a Dios o encuentran a Dios de diversa manera. En esta multitud, en este abanico de religiones, hay una sola certeza que tenemos para todos. Todos somos hijos de Dios. Creo en el amor. Creo en el amor. Creo en el amor. Creo en el amor. Confío en vos para difundir mi petición de este mes. Que el diálogo sincero entre hombres y mujeres de diversas religiones conlleve frutos de paz y justicia. Confío en tu oración.
Seus, Lucifer matutinus inveniat. Ive, in quam Lucifer, quin eschit ocasum, Christus filius tuus, qui regressus ab inferis, humano generis serenus iluxit, et tecum vivit et regnat in saecula saeculorum.